Well, uh, good morning, ladies and gentlemen, uh, and uh, let me uh, welcome you uh, all, and especially NATO Chiefs of Defense and the Strategic Commanders to uh, their first uh, military uh, committee meeting of uh, this year. I would especially like to mention uh, the three uh, new members of our team. General Joseph Dunford from the United States, Admiral uh, Evangelos Apostolakis uh, from uh, Greece, and uh, this is also the first uh, meeting uh, for uh, Supreme Allied Commander Transformation, General Denis Mercier. Where do I have it? Here. <laughs> Welcome all. So, um, Joseph Engel Evangelos and uh, Denny, uh, congratulations uh, on your appointments. We are all uh, very much uh, looking forward to your advice and uh, contributions in shaping the military committee uh, recommendations uh, to the North Atlantic Council in such challenging and interesting times. As uh, we head uh, towards the Warsaw Summit, uh, NATO is faced by a constantly evolving security environment, which, as uh, we have said um, uh, before, has become the new norm. The most important task for us, uh, the military, uh, military leaders and uh, advisors to our heads of uh, state and government, is to steer a clear course through these rough seas. Therefore, our meeting today aims to establish a common understanding of uh, recent developments and uh, place them into the strategic uh, context. This is the first step in developing uh, coherent responses. We will shape the way forward uh, for the NATO military authorities on our journey to the Warsaw Summit and beyond. Consequently, we will dedicate this morning to intensifying NATO's operational and partnership efforts before we switch uh, to de deterrence and wider strategic questions uh, this afternoon. Firstly, uh, we will meet uh, with our 14 Resolute Support Operational Partners to gain a common view on the coming year. We will debate how best to continue to support the Afghan national defense and security forces in achieving their goals. Our second session on, of the morning is uh, with our seven partners uh, from uh, uh, the Mediterranean Dialogue countries. A key element of this meeting is the further development uh, of the defense capacity of our partners in the region. During the afternoon, uh, we will discuss and endorse the military advice on NATO future uh, strategy, posture and adaptation, which uh, has been developed, uh, developed since our Istanbul conference last September. We will focus on the application of the military strategic effect, deter, protect, contain and project. These effects uh, are required uh, to fulfill the Alliance's core tasks of collective defense, crisis management, and cooperative security. This will become the military contribution uh, to the forthcoming defense ministerial meeting, which uh, is an important milestone in the preparation for Warsaw Summit. The strategic commanders and I will brief the media on the outcomes of our discussions at the press conference this evening. And I would now, now like uh, to thank the media for attending our opening session and kindly ask you to leave the room. Thank you.